Hi guys, it's Intuitive144. I am a psychic medium along with being a physical medium, okay? I say physical medium because I'm able to feel things. All I have to do is look at you. All right, I'm not a tarot reader. I just look at you and spirit gives me messages. Speaking of messages, um, I am going to get into a few messages for Oda Benga. If you don't know who he is, please do your research. All right, um, yeah, $40 for a picture reading, $72 for a 30-minute reading, and $144 for an hour with me. Thank you guys for supporting me. Thank you guys for buying out my wish list. I'm very grateful. Let's begin, okay? So for Oda Benga, Spirit showed me a vision of him refusing to show how he feels because of a language barrier. Um, it feels like most people didn't understand him and he was saddened, but most importantly, frustrated behind that, okay? So... This is what I wrote because this is what I was allowed to like see and feel. So I wrote, did he have siblings? I'm not really educated on him. I'm just speaking on my, my, you know, my gift, right? But I wrote, did he have siblings? It just feels like he missed his brothers or he, I can't say misses because he's deceased, you know, um, but it just feels like he, it, it just feels like he missed his brothers, his family. OK, um, it just feels like he didn't know what was happening to him. And this is very confusing for me. So this lets me know he must have been confused as he was going through that. Right. So on Google, there's a picture of him holding a chimpanzee. And as I'm staring at this picture to receive information, I hear a spirit say he didn't like to be around animals. And obviously, it doesn't take a psychic to tell you that he didn't enjoy his conditions, right? But energetically, for the most part, he feared his life, okay? Now, this is very interesting because as soon as I picked up on that, you know, spirit said Dan um, Daniel and the lions. And that's a biblical story about how Daniel uh, was in the lion's den for some time and he was scared that the lions were going to eat him but God allowed the lion's bellies to be full or it was something where pretty much the lions didn't eat him right um yes yeah, yeah it's just something with like God prevented the lions from eating him so Danielle was safe so they're trying to tell me that you know resonates for Oda old oda banga okay so he was safe and protected from the animals okay um obviously he was treated like an animal right it doesn't take a psychic to tell you that but they also showed me a vision of people feeding him scraps in the vision somebody peels an orange they eat the flesh of the orange and the pill they throw to him as if he's an animal so that was yeah um that was that was something that was something okay so kind of transferring out of that vision um i heard a spirit say him committing suicide was out of fear he would go through that again so when he was released i hate to say release but when he was released freed um he you know committed what he committed because you know energetically he was scared that he would go through that again he was scared somebody would capture him again and he would go through that okay so unfortunately he took his life because of that um you know but i i do want to say oh so I, I this is what i wrote it doesn't feel like he felt free even when he was free okay um it just feels like death provided him a sense of security all right I do want to say it kind of reminds me of enslaved Africans and enslaved people, period, who chose to stay on the plantation after they were freed. It also reminds me of prisoners finally being able to leave jail after serving years or many months and then they purposely hit a CO so that they can go back to jail. It kind of reminds me of like homeless people, you know, purposely, you know, putting on a front as if they're mentally ill so that they can stay in a hospital because it's snowing outside. It's just very interesting. Um, and I empathize with all of those situations, right? Um, but once again, there were a lot of times he did things without fully understanding why or what he was doing because of the language barrier. And once again, it was just too much to bear for him, okay? So I do want to say, and I said it already, uh, suicide, well, suicide, I know I got to be mindful of that word, but 
you know, that was a sense of uh, security for him, okay? Uh, it just allowed him to feel sure of himself that if I do this, I will never go back to that. Um, and yeah, that's what I have for Ulta Banga. I know this is very short. Um, yeah, um, that's what I have for him. I want to say thank you guys so much for the support. You guys have been lovely. Um, $40 for a picture reading, $72 for a 30-minute reading, and $144 for an hour. Good night.